Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals, your buddy John Megacycle here. Another episode of Autonauts vs. Pirate Bots. I was about to say vampires. I don't know what's the matter with my brain. I don't know why this game in particular is giving me such the business about what things are named, but apparently. Oh, whatever. What is it today? Pirate Bots vs. Uh, Godzilla. Why, just why not? Let's just have a delightful time about the whole thing. Why, why not? Ugh, the, the metal Godzilla, why not? The, the one made out of tintanium. <laughs> God, I, I'm i not trying to do that on purpose, but like every single time I've loaded up this game and have done my intro, my brain is like, okay, let's just spin the Rolodex and see what we get. Okay, uh, according to this, it's the Autonauts versus a bunch of baby ducks. Interesting. Not the matchup I would have anticipated, if I'm gonna be honest about it. But it is <laughs> all of Autonauts versus a bunch of baby ducks. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm so... I, I just... I can't. I just can't. Uh, Alright, we're fine. Uh, uh, sulfur, right? I need sulfur. How do I sulfur make? I'm just gonna have to probably look it up. I'm totally just gonna look it up. Okay, I need... is this... that's sand, that's mortar. Mortar. What I need is hand cannon. Hand cannon is gunpowder, gunpowder is sulfur, sulfur is a sulfur processing plant. I should have figured that out. The problem is I have no idea where it is. Stationary steam engine... It's not... Oh, yeah, because it's under military, alright. Bricks, mortar, wooden beam, a bunch of other BS, okay. Uh, right, that's what I wanted the bricks for. Uh, did we win? Because the attack already happened and I wasn't... I wasn't even paying attention, how about that? Okay, this should be pretty simple. And then this is gonna go... I don't care. Sounds good, so it gets wooden beams and... Triangle business. I think I've got triangle builders. I have wooden beam builders, that's for sure. That is floating. It's not already loaded. It is... It is moving. It is part of the trebuchet. Interesting. Uh... 40 seconds? Awesome. Okay. Uh... Clear. Clear, clear, clear. I think... It, yeah, I got three more shots I want to take. Then, uh, feels like we've got this kind of wrapped up-ish, I want to say. Uh, wouldn't be- okay, triangle frames are not implicitly being transported, so where's- Oh. Yes, they are. Hey! Hey, guy! Yeah, I knew it. I had a feeling about it. Okay, very good. As you were- Oh, uh... Forever? There we go. Okay. This gets hauled over to here, where I thought I had a bucket. Man, every time I think I'm gonna need a tool later, I burn it into the mighty, mighty fire. And then every single time I don't need a tool, I leave it alone. I'm a, comp I'm a complicated man, what can I say? Uh, please read that script back as idiot. I'm an idiot. What can, what can I say? All right. Sulfur production facility is going to have to be over here. Twixt more walls and such. Uh, 
And just for looks and sake of looks. More of that, thanks. Okay. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. I'm gonna launch this thing. I'm kind of curious to see if the look is gonna be any different. A cow. Yes. It is no longer there. Cool deal. Alright, yep. Time to get scriggity scrounged. Um, I need coal, I need stone. So how much does this process even produce? I didn't even take too long to figure it out. Two rough stone blocks makes one sulfur. Four sulfur to one gunpowder. One gunpowder to one gun. Man, that is not cheap. That is not cheap at all. Um, what I might do is I might do something like this. So what'll hopefully happen, Duder bringing in the bricks is, or things is gonna bring them right here. Um, sure, let's go through it. Why not? Uh, I need eight. Okay, we got enough. Uh, I need some coal. I wouldn't mind at least... Oh, I have charcoal. You need coal coal. Alright. Uh, what am I talking about? I wouldn't mind to go through this at least one time. Make one of the gunmen... Gunner... Gunnermans? Uh, pure coal is gonna be right over here. Right up. Uh, I'll mine it. I'll bring back a handful. I do not foresee this being an incredibly sustained process. Uh, also, this product, stone, is not limitless. It ver- oh, is this empty? Oh, cool, I can steal a cart. Nice, all right, well, I'm gonna have a cart full of stuff. Gonna have a cart. Gonna have a cart full of stuff. Uh, 32, all right, I can probably knock that out on the quick. Uh, everything else up to this point has been 100% completely renewable. Trees, renewable. Little stones, like the, the rocks or whatever, renewable. Uh, crops, renewable. Metal, renewable. Uh, energy, renewable. What else? Bots are 100% homegrown, renewable. Acorns, tools, all renewable. Uh, the only thing that's not renewable are the big boulders. Now, what would be cool is if there was some method that I could trade for stuff. So money is already an incorporated part of the game, which is already really freaking cool. No joke, that's pretty dope. Um, I was always hoping there would be some sort of economy-esque thing. Uh, but this is still really cool. Oh, there's already some sulfur. That'll save me two rocks. Uh, what am I saying? So yeah, that's pretty cool already. I would like to see some trading. Uh, and with multiple players. So imagine four islands, right? And you have one island that is very rich in coal. You have one island that's very rich in metal. You have one island that's very rich in stone. Whatever, so like metal. Metal, coal, What? what is there? Metal, coal, clay, sand. Basically, everyone's going to have to be all right with making trees and lumber and lumber products, right? That seems fairly logical. Okay, I'm actually going to leave this here. Stashy stash that. Uh, man, I really wish I could steal this sulfur. But that's okay. Uh, good enough? Good enough. Let's go back home. Um, I would love to see that. That's probably asking way, way too much for the engine or whatever, but that would be really cool. 
uh, any games that I could ever see that have an economy or an industry, I love to see multiplayer with that level of cooperation. Um, Factorio, I just, we recently on the Megacycle Entertainment Discord server have just gone through an OAR, oh, well, that was loud, OARC was the name of the mod, and what it did is, like, every single player had their own start area, had their own tech tree, had their own everything. And the, the idea was we also did freight forwarding with it, so you could and should be, like, trading and stuff uh, with the other players, and that was a lot of fun. So, like, games like that really entice me to do stuff like that. All right, I'll take one. I'll take two. Oh, takes two per hit. Wow, that's not expensive at all. I'm really glad I made a bunch. Oh man, am I ever glad I made a bunch? I was like, oh, maybe eight will be enough. Nope. And guess what, nerd? Did I get it right in the corner? Boom, right in the corner, nice. Okay, one, two. I'd like one cannoneer or whatever. Like, I don't need a ton, but one would be nice. Sulfur made. Uh, I guess I also want powder milk. Gunpowder made three. Ugh. Uh. No, get out of that. Or sulfur. Oh man, I need 12 of this. Okay, one, two, three, four. Or charcoal. Stuff is easy enough. I need four fertilizer. Finally, we're gonna use fertilizer. I have so much poops. that quick work messages I right, get them out of the way all right we have uno gunpowder I would like three of them to get the last badge but I'm not in a super rush about it uh, what archer is the most damaged at a, just a very quick cursory glance I think you are so come to me please Oh, I didn't make a hand cannon yet. I made gunpowder. I didn't make a hand cannon. Uh, I need an armory to make a hand cannon. I'm sure of it. Okay, back over here. Hand cannon is gunpowder, some plate, and a boatload of gold. Okay, so plate, plate, pull, pull. Oh, it was only one pull. Whoops. The funny thing is, it didn't even dent my frickin' uh, economy. Okay, got the hand cannon. Archers, by and large, are 50 or 100 damage. Depending on. So 50 or 100. I'm hoping for 75, 175, that'd be pretty cool. 70, I was really close. 130, seven against structure, nice. Uh, how much your health? 5,000 health, oh my. Um, yeah, that's dope. Get in there. Yeah, I could, I could do with two or three more of these. How much health does an archer have? Wow, 1,500 to 5,000, and we're not adding any armor to the situation. Interesting. Uh, I don't have enough stuff for another hitter. I wouldn't mind to get the three so we have the final badge. That should, that should be the final badge, right? Uh... These are all tutorials I don't care about. 
powder mill. Powder mill and then eight operation sandstorm are the last uh, things I should bother with. We got a bit more over bit a bit of a bit of a bit of a little over three hours. Oh, can we see the gun gunner do gun things? Whoa. That is some obscene range. Oh, I like that very, very much. Yes, yes I do. Yes, yes I do. Okay, so my objective now is to get this built. One, two, three, four. I'm not gonna worry about too many of them, but I would not mind to have the thing done. The badge, the badges, there we go. I can talk. I'm a parrot. Okay, two plate and a pull. Chugga chugga wugga. Let's just get this figured out so I know exactly how much resources are required. How many resources? Uh, over here, please. Hey, guess what's ready, fools? Fools. Absolute fools. Pronk. That is officially all their defenses structured. I am now able to make it all the way through the base without any encumbrance whatsoever. Uh, granted, the enemies in the way are going to be an issue. For sure, for sure. But until then, we. Okay, uh... Why are you unable to add to this? Does that help? Oh, you're pulling away. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, are there any stones ready for me to... Yes, there super duper is. Oh my. Oh me, oh my. I do like pie. I thought I just saw some of it disappear. There we go. That should help clean that up a bunch, yeah? Gosh, that looks dangerous AF. Dangerous AF almost sounds like a radio station. Starring uh, Pitbull and the Weasel. I don't know. Yeah, I have no idea. I'm gonna get one more hit of stone. And then we're gonna get one more hit of coal. And that's gonna be that. Then we are just going to assault. And it is going to be amazing.
Okay, uh, Cole is next. Where was we on that? We was here on that. Cool, that was easy. Yeah, that beefed up our reserves very quickly. I'm very confident a full army of gunners would end this whole conversation very, very, very quickly. But I'm not looking for a 100% uh, military victory or anything. I'm not looking for minimalist casualties, even though that'd be nice. Uh, I'm just looking forward to getting that 30, 30 hour mark. So yeah, one more gunner. Boom, 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 boom. We'll clear all this out. No retaliatory, retaliat no, retaliatory, retaliatory capabilities. They can't retaliate. I should have just said that. I don't know why I didn't just say that. Uh, at a minimum, I need, what, six? Very soon, I'll have one more trebuchet shot, and to make things easy, I'm gonna knock out this guy and the flowers. I don't plan on doing any of the flowers. No, the apiary stuff for me. We could find some, I'm sure. Oh, nope. And just in case I miscounted, we're gonna sniggity snag, I don't know, five more pieces. Why not? Okay, nuts to it. We're gonna save the flowers. I changed my mind. Okay. I'm genuinely pretty freaking excited about this because that was the last trebuchet strike I needed, like mandatory style. Now everything else is just Gravy? I mean, now I just have the device as much as I want it, even though I don't really need it. Um, this is the one exception. It's the one piece I'm gonna come and just beat it down. Uh, because it's layered? I don't... I don't know how it works. It kind of looks like that brick wall has different layers to it. So I don't know if our attack only affects the first layer, or if I need multiple. I, I don't know. Actually, dump that right there, please. That should be three. That should be four. And then for fertilizer. Are we actually... Oh, we're probably not getting any more fertilizer because we haven't been milking the cows. Uh, which, again, I'm not going to worry about. I'm just straight up not going to... Not going to concern myself. Cool. There's our three gunpowder. That is the last production award required. Of this, two of this,
This battle seems like it's taking a little... Okay. Uh, it wasn't. I was just impatient. How many we got here? We got five troops right there. Okay. Uh, it's time to get into position. The idea is, yeah, we're just gonna stomp all over everything, which will be great. We'll start over here, push to the left, or from the left, and just careen over and down and clear all this out. It looks very much like I have a clean path all the way. So I have the attack banner. I believe we have everyone on the right code, which I will verify in a moment. Freaking cold dead killer. The microphone thriller. You're gonna be pirate bot only. Everyone stop and go. Uh Yep. Okay. In addition to that, I have five supplementary knights, which I want to arrive as well. Okay. Um we're getting close to not the final fight, but very yeah, we're very close to it. There's two four six Outpost spots? Let me... I don't... That doesn't sound right. Maybe it does. One, two, three, four, five, six. There are six outpost sites left. Um... 60,000 outpost strength. How is there a mechan... Oh, the mechanic must have been... Yeah. Right there. I must not have hit him specifically. So maybe he works on the same premises our repair bots do. Uh, which is they have to have items, right? They use an item to do the repairing, and then that's that. If I had to guess, that's my guess. But also knowing this game, maybe it doesn't bother itself with ammunition, and it just uses an ability that has a cooldown or something, something, something. I don't know. And uh, uh, I'm not using the trebuchet. I'm just straight up not going to use it. Now... Our archers have arrived on the scene first, as expected. I'm gonna run back just a little bit. Stop... to me. I know you are legitimately stopped. When the knights arrive... Okay, knights and gunners seem like they move at the same speed, which is totally fine. Uh, I'm gonna move the flag and then set these guys to go. I want them to arrive dead last. Knights and Gunners first. Archers arrive next. I should save. Oh my gosh, I just realized, like, this is beginning to be the end of all combat. Does not want to attack or anything, or what's going on? Continue the crusade. A post toppled. Excellent. Okay, unit lost. Hey. Get in there. Thanks. Instant reinforcements. Lost two. Lost three. Lose one more and I'll add reinforcements. I don't want to fart around with the whistle too much. There it is. Oh, that's why all the knights went up there. Leaving the archers exposed. Excellent. I guess. Formations and such would probably be really cool, but that might be a little too much to mess with. You guys wanna... You guys wanna dust some fools? Thank you. That's two down. 
Uh, I'm gonna come over here and call up for- oh, okay, that's three down. That was fast. I wonder if I could use the trebuchet against the big bad. Actually, 1500 damage doesn't sound like a lot now that I think about it. Okay, everyone out of threat range. Cool, that was brilliant. What did I just unlock? Uh, the beehive, great. Another thing I'm not gonna build. Let's save, that was a very, very crisp victory. Work messages, I tells ya. I freaking tells ya! Okay, over here. Huh? Um, I could use seven more troops. I would like to start building up reinforcements. So, hello? Hello. Seven. Danka? How many are here? More than seven? Excellent. Just structure. Stop. I literally just need that little wedge knocked out. I don't know why y'all are moving up, but... Excellent. All our base, all outposts reclaimed. Most beautiful. That's exactly what I was hoping for. Alright, so, nope. For the love of all that is holy, this has to be in a very specific order. And we stop and we start. And I think we're ready for the final fight. Um, I really wish there was a way to snap back home. Uh, you're still making troops? Uh, you're gonna make two more. I'm ready for a push. I'm ready, honestly, for a push. Let's get... everyone like... that. And then it's gonna be something like, uh, this. Evat lads, I have no reinforcements. This is legit it. I'm so tempted. Oh, we're gonna be losing units, for sure. And I could take care of, like, eight or nine ninja and C's with this. Eight or nine might be a little hyperbolic, but... And these are troops they cannot rebuild. So that's an important thing. Every bit of damage we're doing is permanent. Why do you keep changing targets? What's going on with that? Uh, this might be a little more f uh, finishing than I thought it was going to be. Finite? Sorry, that was me. Put my water down. Uh, we've cut them down two-thirds easily. I don't know why you guys aren't concentrating on this one duder, but that's okay. Okay, we're gonna biddly bop back. I'm gonna ask for another... How many did I ask for before? Hit me up with 13.
Oh, we still have some knights. Oh, nice. We attack by day and we use our knights. There's almost nothing left. What I kind of want to do is I kind of want to back off right now and rebuild some reinforcements and then send in the goods. But I kind of want to push my luck also and see how far we can take this. Oh, you think he did enough damage to get the Dread Pirate robot's attention? Oh, I think he did. Oh, okay. Looks like he's coming out to play. The hatch will be opening any minute now. Tempted to chuck a trebuchet down there. I do see cannons mounted on this thing, which looks terrible. Is that me down there? Yeah, it is. Okay. All cards collected. Final boss showdown. Flibber me gibbet. Giblet? Giblet? Okay. He made it to me inner sanctum. I'll show you who's boss, or my name ain't be the dread pirate robot, and that it be. Oh my god. 30,000 health. Scurviest bot that ever did sail the seven seas. Badge get. Game set match. All cards collected. Cool. Dust that fool. Uh, like he wants to go to my gunners, but can't get to the gunners? I haven't seen him hit anybody yet. And he's already down a sixth of his health. He's down a third of his health. Okay, I think I am, in fact, losing units. Oof, da. You be a feisty wee fleshy and no mistake. Man, that sounds so creepy to say out loud. You bore me with your tiresome tickling, so ye be. I'll be back to me tower for now. Let me cannons do the talking. It has a hundred health. Oh. Yeah. That seems to be the case. Okay, I'm gonna bounce back and get some actual troops fired up. Uh, how much more you got there, son? How, much, how many? Uh, 16? Okay. I'm just going to be kind of patient, which... I don't want to be. Okay, actually save some troops with that. I'm pretty happy. We're gonna head on back. All the way back. Okay, no mines, no mines, cool. And now, maybe? Nah, how far did we get him? We got him to half! I'm pretty freaking impressed with that. That was a neat little squeamish. Barracks attack imminent. Okay, same same dilly dilly, right? We don't have to really maneuver too much more to make this to make this work. That was all 20. Awesome. Hey friend. Uh actually, you know what? I want to do archers first. I think archers might pay off a bit better. Do I have archers? I do have archers. Hey, hit me up with the uh, fourteen. Is this, uh, yeah, fourteen. I 
Actually, I want to test something. We already have an attack happening right now. What if I use the trebuchet defensively? Does a trebuchet raiding party then also happen? Oh. That didn't do any damage, really? I'm not trying to save scum or anything, I just want to legitimately test and see what the what. It would be cool mechanically if there can only ever be a single attack happening, right? Okay. Because damage was dealt, that does trigger a new attack, which is not what I was trying to accomplish. Good to know. Good to know. Lots of games ha handle that differently. In terms of game timers, right? Let's take, uh... Let's take Dune 2 as an example, right? Uh, every single Imperial Palace that you build has a different cooldown timer in the original Dune 2. In other iterations of the game, Dune 2000, uh, Emperor Battle for Dune, all they did was make the timer slightly faster, question mark, or at a minimum, uh, if you take one out, the timer still keeps going. So it's a, it's a level of redundancy, really, at that point. Okay, I need you lads to get to the front because I don't have an army right now. I really don't. Nine troops does an army not make, but because this is a regular assault and not a trebuchet retaliation, it's three dudes. It's not it's not a lot. Not a lot of dudes. How much extra money do we have? 57 breads after the 50,000 breads? That's not bad. That's not bad. Um, I have more than enough materials. I have more than enough materials to make more gunpowder gunner guys with guns. Oh, I don't have enough coal. Never mind. Yeah, I'm not- I'm not gonna go through all that. <laughs> uh, what is that, 13? All long range, right? Uh... Can I have you guys, like, over here a bit more? Like, yeah, whatever, but like, a little closer? All right, thanks. That's significantly better. Okay, we're done with that. We have nine. Uh, I want another 13. Oh, we're still making things. Never mind. Man, 13 right on the money, though. Only pirate bots. That is a dumpster amount of damage. That's a lot of damage. Uh, beef, beef, beef. We got the cash. No reason to not beef this up, yeah. Beef, beef! So the shots deal 4,000 damage? So knights don't even really matter. Only gunners? Like, is that... How much is it? Like, to take more than one hit? Maybe I should just be using regular bots. 
I do want that damage output though. I really, I really does. Uh, yep. 13, please. Thank you. I don't need more sledgy boys ever. Uh, how are we doing on bows and bowstrings? I think we're doing alright. I love that I can just, in emergency, take a bunch of moldy bread and just crank out, crank out a surplus. Uh, it's weird, but it's funny. And it's weird, but it's funny. Um... I'm, uh, I'm going, I'm going one of two ways. I'm feeling genuinely like just attacking with only grunts. How many are here? Ten? Add to the supply, lads. Yeah, you know what? Let's just do it. Let's just grunt up the joint. Uh, if you could stop moving. Thank you. No. Thank you. Oh, I had an attack structure as well, because I needed to for this part of the thing. Uh, just get there. Alright, y'all are on the move. Do we have four more? We have two more. Just half of what I need. Get at it, son! Why was this guy not moved? Did I accidentally call... What? 28. Uh... Oh, you're waiting for swords. Okay, cool. Also, why... This guy not get... Okay, whatever. I got... I got all the stuff I need. Okay, now I need to scamper my pampers all the way over there. Uh, how's the boss's pep? Low pep. Got him down to about half. So this is gonna be kind of messy sloppy, I think. But, I'm not really worried about it. Am I gonna lose some troops? Oh, yes we are. We got the G runts first. Man, instead of a trike, I probably need, like, an ATV. Okay, that was kind of close. Yeah, I needed everyone to show up. Man. Uh, have at now? Oh, let's save. Uh, we made some really, really good progress, and I don't take autosave as anything. Dang, you lads are fast as F. Okay, but one unit lost. Right, perfect, okay. Oh, it's considered a structure. Boo. This might take a minute. I might actually need some sledgies to get this knocked out. 
at any decent level. Uh, we got it down to 100. Yeah, we're just gonna stick stick it to win. I'm not gonna retreat anybody. Because I'm hoping he's gonna pop out and be like, What's up, fools? And then we're gonna be have a bit of a conversation about it. Knocked him down 2,000, which is neat, but not enough. I lied. I actually really like the idea of sending a bunch of grunts. I think that worked out pretty well. Uh, I need more than five. Uh, how many? Can I get 16? Problem is, we're legit out of swords. Uh, where's my sword master? Sword crude make. Uh, sword crude make. That's the guy, have fun. So we knocked him down about, let's say 3,000 hit points with that little scrap. Um, I will want... I want, like, three sledgy boys. I think that's really gonna help. Um, I think... I think all your code is set properly, is it not? It isn't. Okay, well, good thing I checked. BRB. Yeah, grunts are faster than sledgehammer users. So this makes really good sense for us to have some grunts in the in the army composition. How much extra bread? 17. Yeah, we are working through our surplus, but that's fine. I kind of feel like we're really near the end of the game. I might want to take a break like now-ish. And then come back. I want to wrap this all up into one episode, if possible. Maybe there's another, another boss at the end. I don't, I don't know. Uh, how many we got here? Seven. Uh, we got fourteen. Mostly entirely archers, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, not even mostly. Entirely, entirely. Um, actually, that's a lie. I did just send some troops, didn't I? I did not. One thing I wouldn't mind to do, though, is I think we'll endure one attack before uh, Scribble Scramble. So I'm going to retreat you guys back slightly. Just sipping coffee, watching all this happen. I like it. Human music. <laughs> I like it. Is that one? Oh, is that the cannoneer? Yeah, okay. Uh, what are you making? Another nine? It shouldn't take too much longer. 
And I think this is going to be our final assault. I didn't think to add sledgehammers because I wasn't sure the gimmick of the boss. It's just like fighting a Mega Man uh, bo uh, robot master, right? Like, you go in, you get murdered maybe two twice, and then the third time it's like, okay, I've got enough of an idea on the pattern, even if I don't know the robot master's weapon weakness, I at least have enough information I could dance around and do a good. It doesn't take super long to make these guys. Uh, also, it really makes sense that our budget would be a little squiffy, considering how much I asked for more weapons, right? So, like, not only were we out of bows, but I also increased our capacity. What were we at? 8 out of 10? Now we're 14 out of 24, which isn't 80%, but it's certainly significantly more than where we were. Okay, looks like you've stopped. Awesome. Uh, I'd like your help. Change this to Sledge. Uh... Five. Yeah, why not? Five seems reasonable. Power supply attack imminent. Interesting. move over there. Make that seem a little less crud-tacular. So we have how much? 14. Uh, 14, I'm making 5. That's 19. I'll have 11 left. I guess knights, right? Just a whole mess of... I'll mess a plate mail donned broadsword wheeled in slappy boys. Because that's the noise a so uh, sword makes, right? When you strike someone with it, it's a slap. <laughs> like a trout of some sort. A fish. A fish of some origin, if you will. Imagine, if you will, a trout. That's it. That's, that's all I had. That's the only theoretical I've got right now. Yep, beautiful. This whole thing just handles itself. So, uh, how much is in the attack squad? Like, three biggins? Yep. Three biggins, no big deal. Uh, by the time that attack resolves, I should have my knights. When I have my knights, we should attack, and that should wrap this up? Um, how much time do we have? Two, and, two hours and 45 minutes. We'll be under that 30-hour mark without really breaking a sweat. All thanks to the trebuchet. I don't think I would have been able to do it without panicking constantly without our Ion Cannon-esque weapon. But we have it, and that's a lot of fun. I would like to probably keep this into one episode, so what I'm most likely going to do is... I have a... I'm being pinged enough from work, I do want to sign in and see what's what. So I'm probably going to just pause, and then I'll just resume in like, I don't know, two hours when I'm done with work. But yeah, I would like to keep this all in one episode if I possibly can. Is it critical that I do so? No. It's just for completeness for my sake, I guess. Y'all about to get thumped. Yeah, easy. Easy parcheesy. Excellent. Okay, three more left. Uh, what was our digits? Eleven? In a moment, though.
Yeah, add one more. I think. Yep. I wonder if you could ever see, you know, imagine a graph of our military capacity, just go like, whoa, whoa. It looked like, like a sine wave with the ramp up and the crash and the everything. Okay, I'm gonna save right here. I'll be right back. You won't notice. I, I certainly will. But yeah, BRB. All right. Let's get this party started. Uh, right, I'm making my knights. Yeah. Knights, knights! Um... Yeah, feels pretty good. Awesome, okay. Those are rolling off the theoretical assembly line. We've dealt with our combat. Um... I actually don't need to make knights. Well, yeah, right. So I'm assuming this is going to be a quick thing. And we'll knock them down. And then we'll have we'll have the stuff. So that okay. Right, I'm just gonna keep changing my mind about nine to twelve teen more times. Yep, that's the new math. Nine to twelve teen. <laughs> to thirteen twelve threeve. <laughs> I'm a dork. Alright. Oh, are we actually all through our bread? Oh wow. Yep. Again, the weapons are kind of the the pushing figure here. I'm actually going to tell you to stop. Um, I don't think there's going to be enough benefit if my stuff's going to get one shot anyway. There's all 30. Uh, let's get... Everyone nice and moved over. We'll be able to do a nice, fat, concentrated assault. With little to no worries about it. Where in the hell? Okay, here it is. I was like, I can't find the final base. Um, what I would also pretty much enjoy very thoroughly is probably evacuating all of the this. Oh, there's no way for me to do it remotely. I'd have to pull them out manually. Boo. Hit me up with a fiver. Uh, what I'll most likely do with these five is I won't give them any orders other than... Oh, if they run any code, right, 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 right. If they run any code at all, uh, they count as code. Uh, I was hoping I could do a uh, to me, and then I just ignore them mostly. What are you guys doing sitting there? Oh, you're right. You're part of the defense. Ha ha. Okay, everyone's moving in real nice. Five sledgies, one gunner still. One more? Yep, one more. Uh, I could evacuate the trebuchet and all these defense. That would give me, like, eight more dudes. Uh, if we have problems with this fight, that's most likely what I'll do. Uh, there's not really a reason for me to do much else about anything else. Okay, that's the last of the knights. Our regular grunt troops ought to be arriving on the soonish. Uh, can't, what happens if I delete a thing? Oh! Okay. Uh, that works for me.
Yeah, that that works for me. I'm pretty cool with that. Uh, you three nerds to me. Okay, that freed up six more troops. That's not shabby. So here's the deal. I'm going to give the attack order. I'm going to dash to about here, and I'm just going to tell all these troops to... Where, where'd they go? Oh, well, they're on the way. Uh, to just come to me, which won't use any code, but we'll give them some more cannon fodder for this guy to shoot at. That's the plan. That's the total deal. Uh, what I am probably going to do is put those towers back just so I have them. Yeah, just so they get filled with ammunition and handled. Uh, this might be the final fight. I'm freaking excited. So freaking excited. Uh, what's a good rhyme for excited? Uh, our country's divided, our forces united. I'm freaking excited. There we go. The pirate. Oh no! The pirates are divided. Our force is united. I'm freaking excited. There we go. Get that rap game. <laughs> I'm a dork. Well, I, there's no defense for me being a dork. I'm a dork. Okay. Avat, charge. You. I'm literally gonna get right here. Oh my god. Okay, uh, right. It was 4,000 damage, wasn't it? Uh. Okay, well. Oh! Hey! Okay. Why ye jammy we squishy? Ye topple me. I don't even. I don't even understand that one. Oh, come on! Okay, well, that invalidates a, a significant chunk of my army. Which is fun fortunate. Uh, it's fine. I still want to do what I said I was going to do about it. Are we working them down? We're working them down pretty good. Thank goodness I built enough frickin' archers, yeah? Oh, we got this. Yeah! Uh, I'd be bad, beat a standard challenge, boss boss. I, there was like three or four achievements, I didn't catch them all. Jinx Krivens? Help my boab. What? I don't understand language anymore. You did it! The Dread Pirate Robot is no more. I was wondering when we were going to get our Autonaut Pal back. Boss boss. Dread Pirate Robot disposed. Thanks to you, Operation Spring Cleaning is a rousing success. Settlement Rigel 7 is saved! On behalf of me and my folk, I thank you for saving us in our world. We are forever in your debt. You're welcome to stay if you have any unfinished business. Otherwise, use the red button to call your rocket ship. See you back at base. Okay, mission complete. Quick change! Game complete under 30 hours. I be bad. Complete a standard challenge. Nice. Red button. We're done. Boop. Campaign duration, pirate bots removed, defense bot casualties, outpost reclaimed, gold earned, piece of 8-bit plunder. Nice. In recognition of your momentous achievement, Autonauts HQ awards you with a special new blueprint to use. Allows you to control speed of time itself. Oh yeah! This missile construction allows you to double and even triple the speed of time. I remember that. Now you'll find this blueprint in your collection whenever you start a new campaign. That's dope. Okay. That was a standard run of Autonauts versus Pirate Bots. Uh, worked out very, very well. That last fight was a lot less painful than I thought it was going to be. We emphasized Archers, which was apparently the go-to strat. It worked out very, very well. So, yeah. Um, I don't know, probably give this a couple months of a break and then come back in overclocked and impossible difficulty. See how we do? I don't know. Anyway, thank you all for joining me. Name's John Megacycle, and I hope to catch you next time.
Hey there guys, gals, fans, and pals, thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and game with my crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.